I You haven't spoken to me in about three days. You must want something. Yeah, because every time I try to talk to you, you just don't get it, so what's the point? That wasn't very nice. You know, I'm still your mother. You still have to talk to me. See, this is what I mean. And yes, I do need something. I need you to take me up north to my friend Jane's house. Absolutely not. To go God knows where for God knows how long. And for what? So my teenage daughter can hang out with boys? Not boys, mother. A boy, Jimmy. And all my friends will be there. And there will be parents there too. God, I wish you'd get some friends. Maybe, if you had people to hang out with, you wouldn't be in my business all the time. I am not in your business. You don't even let me get into your business. And you don't know anything about me. I do have friends. You know what? You win. I'll take you. But do I have to pick you up? Nope. Jane's parents can bring me home. Thanks, Mom. Really, Stacy? Listen. You need to pay attention to the road. You don't even have your license yet. I let you drive so you can practice, okay? Be more careful. You know, when I was your well, age... Let me guess. I never dreamed of driving a car before. I had to work 60 hours a week on my parents' farm, milking the cows, tilling the land. Yeah, yeah, I know. Why do you have to be so mean to me? Well, Mom, first of all, you're not even nice to me. And it, for you judge me for everything. You never take my side. You know, why can't you be more like Jane's mom? She's so nice. She's really cool. She, Jane never gets grabbed. And her mom takes her shopping every week. I'm going to tell you something. Okay. That's not being a perfect mom. All right? I do this because I love you. All right? One day when you have kids of your own, you'll understand. Now listen, we need to get gas. Stop over here, because who knows when the next gas station is. Let's pull over right here. I'm pulling over. You ready to go? Yeah. All right. Come on. Hey, Mom. Will you keep an eye out for North Hill Road? Okay. It's a shortcut. Jimmy said it will save us a couple of hours. No. What do you mean? We have to follow the directions. I mean, it, it's gonna save us time and I, I'm... I'm not sure about that. I don't think it's a good idea. Just trust me. Yeah, that's what your father said. That's not funny. It's coming up. I see it. Oh, okay. No North Hill Road. Yeah, yeah. Stacy, what's going on? Oh, I, th I think the car might have run out of gas. No, we got gas. I was pumping gas and then Jimmy texted me and, I, and then you came out and you were ready to go and... You, you didn't pump gas because you were too busy texting? 
I knew I shouldn't have gotten you that phone. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh, okay. Look up what the nearest place is, please. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh. <clears throat> Um, Mom, I don't have any service. I'm so sorry, Mom. All right, just relax a minute, okay? Believe it or not, this happened to me before. But, uh, whatever. Listen, we're gonna be all right, but we're, we're probably gonna have to sleep in this car tonight, okay? Listen, we're gonna be okay, all right? We have each other. So, uh, what are we gonna do now, Mom? Well, go look for the nearest gas station or anybody that can help us out, honey. of a plan. Okay. Mom! I found a dead guy. What? Wait! Mom, look! There's a skull. Oh my gosh, honey. Honey, listen to me. He was buried alive. Do you want to end up like that? We have to get out of here. Mom, just let me grab the backpack. The backpack? There could be do you Do you want to end up like that? Maybe there's candy bars in there or something, but we'll never know if you don't let me take the backpack. Candy back bars? You don't, I don't know. What did hikers do when they go on hikes? They gotta have energy, gotta have sugar, candy, candy bars. Honey. Maybe there's some in there or maybe there isn't. Honey. But if you don't, if you just, if you don't let me grab the bat, maybe it's empty, but if you don't let me get it, we'll never know. Just grab it. Careful. See, not so bad at all. It's a little dirty. Oh man, there's definitely stuff in here. <laughs> hey, toilet paper. You always need that, right? Living in the wild. This is perfect, honey. I told you, I told you! <laughs> We're gonna get home! Let's go. Let's get out of here. We can build shelter right here. You know how to build a shelter? My grandpa used to bring me out and he taught me everything I know. You'd be surprised. I am surprised. <sighs> Honey, I'm gonna need you to just go out there and get sticks and whatever you can to build a fire, okay? Okay. I'm gonna stay here and try to get us some food. Okay. Okay. Right. All right.
Are you ready to fish? I guess so. All right. Well, I need you to find some worms. Can you do that for me? Oh, that's good. Right? The line is out. Oh, so this is how my grandfather taught me how to catch fish. We don't have to stand here now, so let's go build our shelter. Okay. Mom, you gotta get the gas. Here. This was in the survival kit. The matches. I'll let you light it. Really? Yeah. Mm. Isn't that nice? I love you, Mom. Aw, I love you too, honey. We're gonna be okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, <gasps> I think we have dinner. <gasps> You ready to eat? Yeah, buddy. Oh my gosh. We gotta get out of here. We gotta what get out. was that? It's wild animals. What? It is dangerous out here. We have to get out of here. Do you understand? Let's get to the top of this hill. From up there we'll be able to see houses or something. We can do oh. it. We're almost there. <laughs> now what? You know what, Stacy? I'm kind of glad this happened to us. I am too, Mom. I know you're always trying to teach me lessons and I take it the wrong way and I'm rude and bitchy and just disrespectful. I think, you know, everything happens for a reason and I, like what if I had my license and I came here by myself and I forgot to get gas and my cell phone was dead? Like. What would I would have done without you? We're gonna just get along from now on, okay? I don't want to fight with you anymore. No. I love you, Mom. I love you too, honey. So now we see. There's really nowhere we can go. Nope. 
we're gonna have to go back to camp, okay? Okay. We have to go get warm. Are you lost? Oh, who are you? I'm a writer. Do you know where you are? I sure do. I know this place like the back of my hand. Uh, okay. Uh, can you help us get out of here, please? Absolutely. Uh, <laughs> Follow me. 